2023 and 2024, all states are just about be ready to implement the new modernization pre-trip inspection. It's a safety inspection of all critical safety items. And many students will say, well, why? Why have this checklist? Well, it doesn't show you how to do a pre-trip, but it checks off. You go around to emergency equipment and you expect, make sure you have all three emergency equipment. You have wipers and washers, make sure those washers and wipers are working properly, etc. And when you get a job, you go out and pass or get your CDL license, every driver will have a vehicle inspection report. And this is similar to the checkoff list. You have a pre-trip and a post-trip. And if you open up the book, you'll see it is pretty much the same as your checkoff list. So that is why we are using a checkoff list. This is what we use in the trade. Same thing. You got an air compressor, make sure it's not leaking, security mounted. Make sure all your airlines are working to have no air leaks. You check your battery for corrosion, etc. And there it is. Doesn't show you how to do it, but it's a guide. The same thing as the vehicle inspection checklist. When you go to a school, a good idea is to use this vehicle inspection checklist and do a pre-trip every day. Learn how to use it. You, you inspect an item. You check your uh, heater and defroster, make sure it's working properly. All vents are working, air is coming out of the, the defroster and the heat, and then check it off. Make sure that it's good, that's working properly. And you're gonna get into a rhythm the same way that you would do when you do your driver inspection report, when you get a job. So every day when you get a job, this is what you should be using every day on at school, at your CDL school.